Today, I invite you to join me on a delightful journey as I breathe new life into a small chest of drawers using the mesmerizing art of chalk paint. My adventure begins with the color graphite, carefully selected from the exquisite palette of Annie Sloan. This deep and velvety color lays the foundation for the transformation that awaits. I apply two coats of graphite, allowing each layer to dry in between, like an artist patiently waiting for the canvas to reveal its secrets. So my base coat has dried, I put two coats of graphite on and now, now I'm going to go for my next step. I took a can of the color Olive of the Annie Sloan Chalk Paint range. I took an oval brush and uh, I am going for the dry brushing technique on top of the graphite. For the dry brushing technique you take just a tiny little bit of paint, you rub it off on a piece of cardboard uh, and when there's hardly any paint left at all on your paintbrush, you start painting on top of your base coat. You go very light-handed, no stressing at all on the paintbrush, and so just a tiny little bit of paint will be left on the piece. You can do heavy uh, dry brushing, you can do light dry brushing, uh, depending on the look that you're going for. Rub it off, no paint left, hardly any. See what's happening here. Well, let's take you a little bit closer. With delicate strokes, I gently brush the olive over the graphite base, bringing out its wood grain texture and lending it an organic allure. The enchanting dance between graphite and olive gives birth to a captivating harmony as the piece transforms into an artwork with a story to tell. But my journey doesn't end there. I revisit graphite, turning my attention to every nook, cranny and edge. I apply graphite using the dry brushing technique once again, embracing the shadows and giving depth to the piece. At first, it may look as if I am making everything look worse. But trust me, this is where the real magic lies, in the layers. These shadows add character, creating a symphony of shades that invites you to explore its intricate details. And then I return to Olive, lightly brushing over the graphite surface. This subtle touch softens the edges, blending the two colors seamlessly.
The result is an understated elegance where transitions flow like a serene river, inviting you to run your hands over the piece, feeling the harmony between colors and texture. Preservation is paramount, so I grab my can of Clear Wax, a guardian of beauty and longevity. I apply the wax using a wax brush while making brush strokes that go in any direction. I make sure that I don't miss any spots so the chalk paint can embrace its protective layer that will give it a soft sheen that not only preserves but also enhances the essence of our creation. Now it's time to play with contrasts. With black wax I accentuate the nooks, the crannies and honored handles. Armed with a small round brush I apply the dark accents with precision, then tenderly wipe away the excess, revealing a mesmerizing play of shadows that add depth and character to the piece. Every masterpiece deserves a touch of opulence, and so does mine. Therefore, I turn to my little jar of posh chalk patina in the regal hue of pale gold. I apply the patina delicately using the tip of my finger, as if signing a work of art. The result is pure opulence, an homage to craftsmanship where the handles shimmer with a golden grace. And 
we are done. Before I reveal to you the final result, let's have a quick look at how this chest used to look like. And here is how it looks now. Look at the remarkable result of our artistic odyssey. This small chest of drawers, once unremarkable, now stands transformed into an enchanting work of art. Graphite, olive and chateau grey is a perfect combination to create a timeless elegance. Preserved with clear wax, accentuated with black wax and adorned with a bit of pale gold patina, this chest now lights up any room. A treasure rediscovered. A story retold. I am deeply grateful that you joined me on this magical expedition. If you have enjoyed this artistic adventure, remember to hit that like button and subscribe to New Renaissance for more captivating tales of creativity. Until we meet again, may your hearts be open to the beauty that surrounds us and may you embrace the artistic spirit in all that you do.